Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, Sidekir. In this video, I'm going to compare the Anubis Punk test scores comparison between the Diamond City 9000 processor versus Snapdragon 888 Plus chipset. Let's see how much difference we can actually observe between these both processors regarding the benchmark wise Snapdragon 888 Plus and the Diamond City 9000 processor. So, this is the latest processor from the MediaTek, which is a 9000. And the Snapdragon did launch the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 uh, series, but I just want to compare with the Snapdragon 888 Plus how much difference it's going to be there regarding the benchmark marks so here's a quick comparison between these both uh, processors Diamond 9000 processor versus Snapdragon 888 Plus so this is the highest score which the Snapdragon 888, Pro Pro 888 Plus processor did reach 8,47,000 this is the ICO 9 device which I'm trying to use in this video for the demonstration which has got the Snapdragon 888 Plus chipset you can clearly see the difference so it's kind of close to uh, I think 1 lakh difference is there usually you can clearly see in this kind of comparison regarding the redmi k50 pro this is a redmi k50 pro which has got the dimensity 9000 chipset so this is a screenshot which are gathered friends from online regarding the benchmarks so right now i do not have the redmi k50 pro device but i just want to show you how much difference it can be there cpu scores 238 versus 217 394 versus 325 regarding the gpu scores and the same Redmi K50 Pro did get up to 10 lakhs 20,000 as well regarding the benchmark scores. Yes, this is the highest score the Redmi K50 Pro did reach up to. Damage 9,000 processor. And clearly see friends how much difference is there right now at this moment. So overall friends, the Damage 9,000 did have the potential to increase more than 10 lakhs. So it will be around close to 1.5 lakhs to 2 lakhs difference will be there regarding the benchmarks side by side between this both processor exactly. That's what I thought of demonstrating to you clearly what's happening between this uh, both processors regarding the benchmark wise. So that's it friends, thank you for watching and even my Snapdragon 888 Plus chipset did reach around this kind of figure most of the time. As you can see, 8 lakhs 45,000, 8 lakhs 43,000, 8 lakhs 47,000. This is a normal usual score I used to get in this ICO 9 device. Meanwhile, signing off friends, thank you for watching. Until then, stay for more updates and bye.